Are you serious? Really? Do you think there's a possibility <clears throat> that you, I mean, this guy actually grew back the muscle, the cellular structure that would be the uh, uh, collagen, the veins, the tendon, the bone? Oh, it grew back all that stuff. See? What'd I tell you? Who freaking needs prayers and deities and supernatural superstitious magic when you've got great scientists who if you allow them to do the critical thinking they need to do without, you know, fear of a, a, some kind of retribution from some Christian saying you're acting like God, some other bullshit statement. Otherwise, I'm so happy to hear about this. This could mean that I could possibly walk again. I might walk again. I can't believe, I cannot describe I can't describe the. <laughs> I'm so fucking happy. I cannot describe the feelings I'm having right now about this. It's just incredible to me. I can't believe it. I really can't. So, that's my answer to this. I take a video, good video. But it's a good message to put out. Really, there's a lot of places this stuff can work. You know, a lot of battle wounds and such. Oh yeah, and then there's we amputees who would mind having our limbs back. <laughs> That'd be great. Go to your nearest store and buy yourself a new arm. <laughs> wow, incredible. The mind of the human being. It's an amazing evolutionary tool that just came on the scene and immediately made us knowledgeable of many things just that they couldn't understand them yet. But as we go, we understand more and more. The deities get farther and farther behind. You know, like, okay, get back there in the corner. Shut up. Now, let's get back to work. Come on. Stem cells. That's another one. I noticed that within this system, they, they were thinking about using that matrix and, uh, did, you know, and also inject stem cells because they're also a uh, uh, big message uh, cells, structures that tell the other cells what to do. Kind of, you know, you know what stem cells are anyway. So, that's my answer. Thanks a lot. I'm Gerald, just an earthling, and this is Portland, Oregon. And if you're in Oregon in November, vote yes on Measure 74, please. Yes. I need to get my medicine without having to grow it. <laughs> it's just too much trouble. Thank you. Good night.